Welcome everybody back to another bold cast reaction. I'm Lindsay. I'm Carson. And today we are watching Clannad episode seven. What happened last time? The, they're having the cultural festival. Fuko is passing around all of her starfish to everybody. And she just had a, like a confrontation or an encounter with her sister who, mm -hmm. uh, the main characters brought to the cultural festival or whatever it's called, the cultural festival, school festival. Some kind of festival. And uh, she can't see her younger sister who's like a ghost, but she's the only one who can't. So that's kind of weird. Mm -hmm. uh, wonder what that, what's going on there. Um, Yeah. We'll find out hopefully in this episode of Clannad. If you like this video, make sure to like it, make sure to subscribe for future videos. If you want to, you can check out our Patreon where you can get early and uncut. And with that, let's get into it. Nah. <laughs> nah, she's not waking up. This is very cute, though. <laughs> That's so cute. <laughs> <laughs> this is probably my least favorite character. I think if so, being 100% well. honest, I really don't like this girl. <laughs> I just come harass her and eat lunch with her in the library every once in a while. And help her vandalize school properly, <laughs> property or at least don't report her for it. <laughs> Oh my god, she just keeps going. <laughs> she just gets so riled up about like every interaction. <laughs> <laughs> they get in a bad I'm not even gonna try to no. to participate. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Sounds like a Don't make a face like you did it perfectly. <laughs> like a chicken or something. <laughs> Me. <laughs> I can't whistle. I can't whistle either. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> Carried away. 
Are they gonna put on the wedding? Hmm. I've never heard of somebody wanting to get married no. at, the, at the high school. <laughs> or she wants to get married surrounded by the students and teachers there. <laughs> I feel like that would be the last place a teacher yeah, would Yeah, 100% married. talk to any teacher. They're like, fuck that, dude. Flashback. Starfish. Why? To force her to like <laughs> reach out to other people? It's a poor strategy if I ever heard one, to be fair. That's not a good strategy at all. And then she got hit by a vehicle. Boom. No, it was after, because she remember she did try and make friends. Yeah. She met that girl. <laughs> Still only in it for the pastries. <laughs> 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 Something else. <laughs> <laughs> Please come to my sister's wedding. <laughs> or else. <laughs> You'll accept it one way or another. <laughs> I don't like the whispering. <laughs> Dang, go. <laughs> I'm on her side. It's always I'm cute. on her side too. Maybe you could draw what? draw little faces on the starfish. Just the little eyes. Mm -hmm. Oh God. A cuteness fight. It's a waifu wars. <laughs> I understand the appeal. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe they should write a starfish song. <laughs> oh God. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> nice. Good job. I knew there was something weird here. She's like finding reasons why maybe she just doesn't want to marry the guy anymore. Or she doesn't want to do it without her si Oh. Or she's already dead at the hospital or something. Oh shit. I mean, we all knew it was coming. This is like actually the worst thing, just becoming really good friends with someone After who's like already... already <laughs> who's yeah. a ghost and unconscious and... That's why she's disappearing. That's why less people are noticing her. Like that girl in the hallway this time. Yeah. <laughs> what are they gonna do about it though? Have the wedding as soon as they can. Starfish, starfish, starfish. Starfish. <laughs> It'd be funny. What if they do that for like the episode where she dies? <laughs> that would be really yeah. They're all stars. Yeah. Just one ed ending for one episode. That'd be really nice. Why is this just like such a relaxing s song? What'd you think of that episode? Didn't super like that episode, if I'm being 100% honest. That that one- That one felt super, super dragged out to me. Yeah, they didn't have, I guess because it was a bit more of a serious topic, but they didn't have, like the- There wasn't filled enough, up The yeah. other ones was the comedy and like just random shit. And like they had that, but you were kind of distracted by like the bigger picture that was going on. Yeah. So the episode just felt like, th like stuff was happening the whole time, but it like, that the stuff that the the stuff that they filled in the parts where the main plot wasn't happening wasn't very good because yeah. I was just like well and for the first half they were still just passing around you know like it was to set up that she's mm -hmm. like disappearing and stuff but it was still like I think that was the first episode that I didn't like of this show I think that was I wouldn't say I disliked it but it it, it wasn't as good compared to previous ones yeah um but. Yeah, they're like really gearing up to. Mm, to mm. For I have a to... hard time feeling sad about it because of just like it's so telegraph. Like it's so, she's um, going to disappear. Like... They're fully setting up for it, and like, yeah, I don't know. I I I don't I don't know. I like I don't know what it is. I'm just not soup getting super invested in in this part of it personally. I wish I was. I'm really open to it, but I just can't. I'm not like feeling my heartstrings really my not my heartstrings aren't really getting pulled by this just cuz uh yeah. yeah I'm, I'm, I not, guess, I'm not 100% I guess, sure why. I I don't know if maybe it's we've just seen like too many of this like kind of thing maybe or what because I remember um, spoilers? Are you going to I was going to say spoil anything? Like not 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 really spoilers for Angel Beats. Like when the really sad episode in that happened, I didn't really see it coming, but I had originally hated the character and then, like, grew to love them yeah. and then was really devastated um, when that happened. But with this, I'm like, I feel like every time I see her being cute, I'm like, oh, she's being really cute now. Yeah. But they're showing me that so that I'll be sad when they kill her off in a few episodes. Yeah. Um, but I do, I will say I do like the older sister. I like the older sister. Um, yeah, I like the older sister. Mm -hmm. Yeah, she, she, uh, like, I guess sort of 
brings an interesting element to it because she, like, when they talk to her and she's just, like, she had apparently had heard about all this stuff about, like, she heard her little sister's ghost was, like, running around the school and she's just, like, well, I kind of, like, I I don't really believe it, but I kind of hope that it's true and she is just having fun and, yeah. you know, and, yeah, and now she's... She's now she has said, oh, yeah, I want to, like, have the wedding and do all this stuff and be happy. But then Fuku gets worse in the hospital and then everyone can't see her. And it's just like it just like sucks. But it seems so, like it seems like there's nothing you can do about it rather than just try and do the wedding as soon as you can, as best as you can. Yeah. And I mean, the only thing that would really like I just I'm just not feeling like uh there's only one way this can go. And if I maybe maybe it's cuz we're taking time in between it, but I don't think so. Uh I I just I don't know why. I'm just not I I don't think I'm like super attached to Fuko really. Uh I'm not sure. I like her. I think she's funny. But maybe yeah, maybe it's just the comedy isn't hitting quite as hard. Like I don't I don't I I'm just grasping at straws trying to figure out like why I'm not like fully engaged in like this part of the story. I but I can't think of any like concrete reasons why. I just like the only thing I just don't I yeah, I don't know why. Like the only thing that would really surprise me at this point is if she was if she didn't die. If she like woke up and like moved moved on or or was in the hospital and showed up a couple times throughout the rest of the series. That would like really be surprising to me and that would be nice and I like cuz I'm not expecting that. I but part of me knows like What's going to happen is they're going to, the marriage is going to happen and uh, a bunch of people are going to be there. It's going to be like a big climactic moment. And she's going to disappear. And she's going like, to disappear. And maybe her sister's going to see her for like a glimpse, like a shimmer of her or something. And it's going to be really dramatic. And if like, and I don't like, cause I like, cause okay. The reason I'm having trouble saying that it's like, I'm not, I'm, I don't feel like I'm going to be surprised and I'm making a lot of judgments before we've actually seen it. But like, Usually, I, I hesitate to say stuff like this because surprise, I don't, like, it, it's such a difficult thing because obviously spoilers are bad if you're spoiled on what exactly is going to happen. But, like, you sh you shouldn't always, like, write something off just because you expect something to happen. Yeah. Or even if you what you expect does come to pass, it's like, you know... Uh, there's only so many things that can happen and that, that like the most predictable stories can bring out such a strong emotional impact in you. So to like write something off because you know what's going to happen is kind of stupid, but I, so I, but I'm having trouble like coming up with another reason why I'm like not feeling this part of it, mm -hmm. you know, I just, I and I don't want, like, I don't like talking about it in this context, but I feel I feel like kind of shitty just being like, oh, well, I don't really like this. Let's get through it and move on and just end the discussion there. Mm -hmm. I just feel kind of shitty about it because I do want to enjoy it. I do really want to be engaged, but I just am not. And I can't really say like, I, I don't really understand why. Yeah. I can't quite put together why. Yeah, I feel I just I feel like I'm not as invested as the story thinks that I should be. Exactly. It's the thing. Yeah. It's not that I'm like completely not that's, invested. That's exactly true. Cuz I do I like I like the show so far. I like the characters, I like the humor, I like where they're going but with the it. But the show is expecting a level of engagement that I'm just not feeling. And yeah. I can tell it's operating as if I'm like super stone cold like right there with them, but I'm just I'm not feeling that level of it with with the show but i guess there's kind of a sour note to leave it on i want to see i want to see the next episode to see if that'll uh change but yeah mm -hmm. anything else you want to say no I guess, I guess that's pretty much it thank you guys for watching if you liked this video make sure to like it maybe leave a comment and subscribe if you want to get to the next episode right away that'll be up on patreon you can check that out the link's in the description and have a good day Bye bye